Welcome to Bedtime Tales for Kids. Tonight we will be reading Ava's Big Move, Once Upon a Time. There was a little bird named Ava. Ava was just like any other bird, with bright blue feathers and a cheerful chirp. She lived in a beautiful nest that her parents had built some time ago. The nest was made of twigs and colorful leaves from a maple tree. The nest was warm and made Ava feel so safe. But one day, it began to rain and the wind began to howl. Ava looked at the dark sky and knew that a storm was coming. She flew out of her nest and sat on the branch of the tree that held her nest. Ava ruffled her blue feathers to shake off all the rainwater as she watched the clouds gather all around. Then the wind blew and blew and blew. The wind blew so hard that it carried away Ava's nest. At first, Ava was sad and she was scared. She didn't know what to do. As the wind calmed, the rain stopped and the clouds disappeared. Ava got all the courage she had and flew to the top of the tree. She knew that she needed to build a new nest, but she was scared. Then, she remembered something her mother had told her when she was just a little hatchling. Whenever you're scared or unsure, just remember to ruffle your feathers, shake it all off, and put on a brave face. With those words in mind, Ava set out to find things to build her new nest. She searched high and low. She saw her friend's father mowing the lawn, so she picked up the grass with her beak. She flew towards a forest and saw lots of twigs on the forest floor, so she picked up the twigs with her beak. She saw a cotton ball swaying on the ground where an old lady just did her laundry. So she dived down and picked up the cotton ball with her beak. She gathered and gathered until her little beak could not carry any more. Soon enough, Ava had gathered twigs, cotton balls, grass, and leaves to make a cozy new home. But as she was building, she realized that it was harder than she thought. The twigs kept breaking, the leaves and grass kept falling, and the cotton balls kept bouncing out of place. Ava was tired and wanted to give up, but she thought about her mother's words and kept on going. She built and built and built. She built until the sun left the sky and the stars came out. Finally, after many tries and a lot of hard work, Ava's new nest was ready. It wasn't as grand as her old nest, but it was sturdy and it was safe. Ava felt so proud of what she had built. She sang a joyful song and chirped away into the night to celebrate her new home that she had built all on her own. The End